Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the channel. I just froze up. Let's try it again. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the channel Life Cycle. And today I'm going to be taking you guys out here in the suburbs to do a little bit of Uber Eats on my bike. All right, what's up guys? So, uh, so far, you know, just started the trip, just started the journey, the uh, adventure. Um, I did receive a $13 order, but I did not accept it because it was, it was from KFC and they are very unprofessional in my area. So I'm going to avoid the wait time <clears throat> and uh, just the wait time because I remember last time I showed up and they said, oh, it's going to be 20 minutes. And then I, when I came back, they gave my order away to somebody else which I was very mad about because it was like a high dollar order just like this one. So I just, just you know, didn't accept it, didn't want to uh, do that again. So we're still waiting on our next order and stay tuned uh, for that. So I'm gonna show you guys how I killed time uh, when, my next, my, when my next order pops up. This is how I killed time. Try to skid. was like skid or you know flying to this curb and in the rocks <laughs> all right so we oh that's what i'm talking about so we all right so we got our first couple orders uh our first order is to lucky house i'm gonna cross uh we're going to lucky house right now So uh, we're going to a Chinese food place and then we're, we're going about a mile, one and a half miles there and then two miles back. And then we're going to a Indian cuisine, cuisine place, which is a $9 order for a, for a mile. So great first two pickups to start the night. I'm excited. Let's get this night going. <laughs> All right, we're on our way to Haldi Indian Cuisine. Just picked up from Lucky House. We are half a mile away from the spot and then we're gonna drop off and deliver to our customers. Last day of the year, technically. Tomorrow we're supposed to get rain. So this is probably the last video I will be making until next year. Let's see. Alright. We are going to cross. Actually, I'm across. Look both ways. No cars. We're gonna cross. This car. Oh god, that car was turning. Alright, just like that. We're almost there. I feel like I can see the building. It's getting out of my line. See if this car will stop for me. I don't think so. I'm 
looking at the arrow so I could time the light so that I can go before him. But if no cars are turning, oh, he got it. Oh, he was trying to beat me, but another person, hey, it worked out. This person probably doesn't see me, so I'm gonna uh, be, uh, get out of the way. <laughs> around this corner we should be at the building this thing came out of nowhere boom and we're there all right we got our order go ahead and make some room for it boom all right we are about half a mile away from our location let's hop on the bike and bounce skip to that direction uh oh, got to be careful. Oh, I wonder if I could. Dang, I should have went out that way. Taxes. Yeah, I'll get y'all taxes done. It's almost about that time. I feel like they went slow on purpose. <laughs> that was weird. But uh, we're gonna, we're gonna uh, skip to Malou to uh, the location and get back, right back to you guys shortly. In a GIF, I'm like literally right up the street. Just dropped off Lucky House Chinese food. Now we're on our way to drop off our next delivery. Like we're getting another order. Red Robin. Let's do it. So we got another another order to Red Robin. Oh, our first order for today. Our third order for today to Red Robin. So, uh, I'm pretty sure they'll probably give me a double once I get over there. That's what I, uh, that's what normally happens when, when it's like a low dollar order for three miles. And then it will say, it'll say something like, oh no, I'll just get another additional order on my way toward, towards the location. And I'm going to look at this, uh, this. Either those are fireworks or not fireworks. And the code is the code. As I type in the code, a, a car is right behind me. I hate when that happens. So uh, I'm just gonna get out the way. Let this person go by. We're looking for a building. We're on our way to Red Robin. Just dropped off. Our oh, almost fell. Very dangerous to. Uh, it's not dangerous, but I don't recommend anyone, you know, riding their bike with one hand. But if that's all you have, that's all you have. On our way to Red Robin to pick up our low dollar delivery. Hopefully we'll get another alert that uh hopefully we'll get no low another alert. I can't even talk right now. That uh hopefully we get another alert that 
hopefully we get another order to our to me <laughs> i'm just gonna stop the video because i keep messing up see you at red robin couple miles so I just left out of Red Robin and my order was giving given to somebody else um, so now I'm heading to Pyology to pick up same order amount the same dollar amount order that I would pick up at Red Robin but I bet it's a big it's probably a 10, 10 inch pizza guys so we just delivered our biology now we're on our way to Chipotle all right so we just went inside and picked up our Chipotle on the way to Chipotle I received another order I received another order from, from Panda Express so after I zip this up we're gonna head over to Panda Express and pick up our $10 order. Crowd. This freaking semi truck got in the way. So I don't know if he's going or. Something's just telling me to just go straight, but I don't want to go straight. Fuck it. wasn't even in the fucking turning lane. That's crazy. Y'all not gonna believe this. So I was riding by and I found a dollar. Hey, this is my lucky night. I 
I found a dollar. When do you, oh shit, that's not like a dollar. When do you ever find money on, on the street? Late at night, never. All right, so we just made it to Del Taco to pick up an $11 order. And on the way, I can't find it, where is it? On the way here, guess what I found? I found a dollar, it's in my sock. I can't reach it, but found a dollar. Now I have to show it. Here it is. Oh. 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 It's real. Wait, hold on, let me check to see if it's real. One way you could check if uh, you, you can see the one dollar line. But it's a dollar. Come on, no one's gonna check to see if it's a counterfeit. Oh. All right, so we got our order. We have our Del Taco order. Not gonna lie, the guy was kind of rude when I, you know, coming in, but he kind of changed his attitude. He changed his attitude when uh when the order was done. I guess well, he's just a strict person, I guess. always busy fast pace so hey you know fast food lifestyle is not for everybody stressful but uh, we're on our way to drop off this del taco and complete our adventure doing uber eats on my phone. See if I oh I could stay there. I should have hopped it next time. Well I don't wanna <laughs> risk it. Risk a flat tire. $4 order for Taco Bell. Not accepting it. He told me to turn my light on. Better does he know? That's my phone. Coming up on the location. See you guys in the gym. All right, so we just delivered our last Del Taco order. I think I'm gonna head home. It's gonna start starting to rain. My battery's low. I didn't get the chance to grab my portable charger cord. Not my portable charger cord. I have my portable charger, but I just don't have the cord to attach to my phone. Plus it's 50 degrees and raining, so I don't wanna risk getting sick so gotta be smart call it a night thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it please subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed uh what else hope you guys enjoyed the video found it helpful if you have any questions Please leave your questions in the comments below. Thanks for watching.